Did you know that the high schools in the Stafford area have really unique programs? Clients tell me all the time, wish I knew all about these. So in this video today, we're gonna to talk about all the really unique programs that Stafford County High Schools has for our students. Hi, I'm Ginger Walker, the team lead of Give Back team of Coldwell Banker Elite. And welcome to this episode of Give, Work, Play, where we're gonna talk about everything living and giving in Northern Virginia. And today we're specifically gonna talk about moving to Stafford County and all the programs that the high schools have to offer. Stafford County is home to five amazing high schools, Colonial Forge, Mountain View, Brook Point, North Stafford, and Stafford. Stafford High School. And each one of these high schools offers different and unique programs. And they're all about five miles apart, more or less. So before you move here, you really want to know which high school has the best program for your students. So the first high school I want to talk about is Brook Point High School. It's located on the east side of Route 95 and Route 1. It has the International Baccalaureate Diploma Program, known as the IB program. It has AP classes. And it also has the Navy JROTC program. It also has the STAT program. What's that, you ask? It's the Governor's STEM Academy for students that are interested in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. I know, it's a mouthful. And that one is at Brook Point, and that's the home base for their IT program as well. So next, let's talk about Colonial Forge. It's only a couple of miles down the road from Brook Point, and it's kind of a sister school, and I'll explain why in a second. But Colonial Forge has the Army ROTC program. They have AP classes. They have the AP Capstone program. I know, it's kind of interesting. That's got the internationally recognized AP Capstone Diploma program, and it studies topics of your choice that are gonna stand out in college admissions process. It's got career and technical education programs. It has the CGS, which is the Commonwealth Governor's School Program. It's got dual enrollment classes, which are called DE. They have Learn and Serve. And then they also have a really unique program where if you're interested in being a paramedic, you can do that at this school. It's called the paramedic class. So the interesting thing about this school is that Colonial Forge and Brook Point actually will share a bus. I know it sounds a little interesting, but if you have a student that's going to one school, and let's just say that they're going to Brook Point as their home base school, and they wanna to go to the Commonwealth Governor School, well, all they do is they get on a bus from their home base school, and they actually will be bused over to the other school. So just down the road from Colonial Forge is Mountain View High School. It's one of the newest high schools to Stafford County. And this high school has the IB program, that International Baccalaureate program. It also has a whole variety of AP classes, culinary arts, as well as cosmetology. I know, it's really unique, right? It also has DE, which is that dual enrollment, and it has the Marine Corps JROTC program. And the unique thing about this high school is its sister school, or where they could go back and forth if they're participating in different programs, would be North Stafford. So let's talk about that one next. Next up is North Stafford High School. It's home of the Air Force JROTC program. It also has the CTE program, which is the Career and Technical Education program. CGS, again, Commonwealth Governor School. It also has the STAT program. So now let's talk about the fifth and final high school in Stafford County, Stafford High School. It's home to the APPX program, Advanced Placement Programs of Excellence. It also has the AP Capstone program, the CTE program, again, that's the Career and Technical Education program, the Commonwealth Governor's School, CGS, and the DE program, Dual Enrollment Classes. So one thing to note, Programs, again, like the Commonwealth Governor School, or CGS, and the STAT program, for example, are ones where there might be busing between the schools. So, for example, my son is in one program, but that's not offered at our home base. So around lunchtime, there is a situation where he hops on a bus, he goes to another school, and then takes four of his classes at another high school and then is bused back to his home base school. However, with some programs, for example, cosmetology, you may not have the busing from one school to another as an option. So you wanna make sure you're considering what program your student and your child would be interested in before you buy that house. In addition, many of these programs students will have to apply for and there is a process to get accepted. So if you have a high school student, you may wanna consider contacting the high school before moving here to make sure that your student meets the criteria that are required to enter into that program. I hope this video gave you some insight into some of the unique programs that Stafford County High Schools have to offer. Please be sure to visit each school's website for additional information, and I would strongly encourage you to reach out to the school directly to get specific information that would help you and your child make the best decision of where you wanna buy your home or build your home in the Stafford area. We help people move every day, not only to Stafford, but also to all of Northern Virginia. So if you need help, we're here to help you as well. So if you like this video and you want more information about the Northern Virginia, Stafford, Quantico, Fredericksburg area, don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel and you probably wanna watch a couple more videos to follow. I'm Ginger Walker, the team lead of Give Back Team of Coldwell Banker Elite. Thanks for watching.